their ship, shelled, set on fire, blasted by bombs and finally torpedoed by an enemy radar in the Indian Ocean, survivors of the Port Brisbane reach an Australian port. These 27 men escaped in a lifeboat under the command of 2nd Officer Dingle, who set a course for Australia. Here is the Commonwealth's reply. In every shipyard, hammers clang and riveters rattle. At Cockatoo Dock, Sydney, a new destroyer, like a greyhound in slips, is ready for launching. The heavens baptise her as the Governor-General, Lord Gowrie and Lord Wakehurst, watch Lady Gowrie christen the ship. I name this ship Aranta. This tribal-class destroyer is named after the finest of the native peoples of Australia. As she glides down the ways, she takes with her the pride of the nation, a nation fiercely resolved to win through to victory. The tribal-class destroyers have proved one of the outstanding successes of the war. This one, built of good Australian steel by Australian engineers, will be heavily armed and have a surprising turn of speed. Mussolini just can't keep on winning the boat race. <laughs> 